Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Benjamin Magnus Plays Europa Universalis 4. Last episode, we took a little bit of shoe right here. We, we lopped off, uh, I think it was these four provinces right there, which actually was very beneficial because we had an army trapped in Chu territory and allowed them uh, uh, access to get out. So now we have uh, free access to both of our armies here. We had a little uprising over here. I bitched and moaned a lot about the Catholics in this series so far. Because it's just oh, it's so frustrating is what it is. So very, very frustrating. Like, it's impossible for me to get religious unity. It's even it's, it's been going down because... Oop, hang on, I'm, checking, I'm just fiddling with my volume a little bit. It's actually going down. We were at 83% before, and now we're at 79%. Although it's going to jump up in just a second here. Let's see how... Oh, there we go. Ooh, it's a little louder than I expected. Whenever I say I'm fiddling with my volume, it never... N n you guys aren't ever going to hear a difference. It's just on my end. On your end, it's always going to be the same volume. 96% way done here. We're almost at 10,000 points, which is kind of awesome. I think I'm going to need... I think if I can get up to about 12,000, I'll overcome the Ottomans. Or actually, we'll, we'll get this one going, and then we'll check to see what their score is right now. What I should also do... Let's uh, keep converting people. Unfortunately, Beijing, I had Beijing Shinto, and it did its random it random conversion thing hit on Beijing, so now that's permanent Catholic for the rest of the game. Oh, come on, you got to be kidding me. So annoying. So very, very frustrating. Uh, okay, these guys we need to send an insult to, so let's do that. Boom. Got got a little bit of points just for that. Uh, incorporate Chu into our country or conquer Portugal. I don't want to incorporate Chu into my country. Uh, I guess we'll just take conquer Portugal. All we have to do is declare war on them, and that would give us what we need. The only problem is is that it would drag so many other countries into it. Like let's uh. They're allied with Great Britain, the U.S., Aragon, Castile, Brunei, and Chukchi. I don't know where Chukchi is. Wow, Poland. Go Poland. Sweden, Lithuania, Poland. That, that's pretty normal. I see that happen most games. They all, all three of those ones expand out like that. Province converts. That's already, what, two this episode? <sighs> France. France is always France. France is always France. England's always England. Always at the top. Ooh, wow. Uh, last time I looked at this, uh, uh, in the month that, that I was looking, they had gained less than a point. But it looks like they've done pretty good. We're, they're doing really well on Diplo. Tech, merchants, trade efficiency, admirals, fleet... Strong alliance, strong allies, that's getting them some ship quality. God, I wish I had a strong ally, but everybody hates me. France dislikes me the least. Let's, uh, let's send a, a, a diplomat over there to see if we can get the French to hate us less. Why do they, let's see, different religion, oh, they're a rival of mine. Can I cancel that? Oh, I'm their rival. I'm not, they're not my rival. Tazakasis Ballet, competing great power. Uh, possible advisors, tech cost. Okay. I, is, you know, like I said, as much as I'd love to fight Portugal, I mean... Well, for starters, we need to get our, our, economy, our economy up. We have the military over here to do it. I don't think I have a fleet over here anymore. Here's a fleet right here. Three deckers, and I think there's a great frigate down there. Yeah, and here's my other... My, I have another fleet over here. Three deckers and archipelago frigates. I would need... Uh, I, I would need more more ships. 10,000! I, I, I got... I got over 10,000 points. Alright, Jesus Christ, would you look at this? And they're, they're converting quicker then I'm I'm converting them over so that's why this is fucking taking forever I could get it up just a little bit higher 
Let's see, by getting my stability, it would only be half a percent, though. Oh, God. Large revolt. I was hoping it would not be over there. Okay, apparently it was in both. Well, you go here. Go, go. There you go. And here's my ships. That Viet declared war on Shu. Not surprising, really. Transport you guys to Setsu, right there. There we go. Very good, very good, very good. Jin. Uh, we don't have any available. Let's remove you from there. We have a an, we have an ally, but it's not a powerful ally, unfortunately. It's just the Netherlands. Uh, we have influence. Oh, we don't have anybody available for starters, so no, we're not going to be able to do anything. All right, that was which one was that? That was this one over here. All right, you're all finished there. You guys are gonna go here. <laughs> Both those combi combatants want to move through my land, and honestly, I don't really care. <laughs> Unfortunately, my fucking capital is fucking Catholic. Alright, so you go hang out there, you're gonna grab those troops and send them back. If I declared war on them, what I would need to do is just make sure my fleets were out to, to you know, try to prevent them from landing. And we would do most of the fighting over on this side. Just taking out the colonies. All, all of North America is taken now. All the provinces are taken. They're, they're all there. They're all... Pardon me, had a little hiccup there. They're all filled in. Not not anything left to do. All right, let's take a look at the ledger and see how the Ottomans did this. Okay, well, let's let's sort by monthly. I'm above Portugal. Okay, I'm above the Ottomans. Second in military rank. So that's that's where I could double down. If I increase the size of my military, that would do it, in or increase the size of my navy. Ships are pricey, though. Hmm. We could use more three-deckers for this fleet right here. Fantastic news! Cooperation with merchant class. Okay. It's three, four, five, six, seven? Seven sound good? to add to that fleet right there, because there's only 14 there now. I mean, I say only 14, like it's nothing. 14 is a decent number. We could actually pay back one of those loans now. Oh, there's only one. I thought there was two. Let's, uh, let's knock that down for a while. Try to get our income back on track. Because right now, having everybody on, you know, really, really cranking on the military there for absolutely no reason is just money I'm not getting back. Oh, a military leader died. I don't know which one. I think we have a free leader here. We do. So it wasn't this guy, and it wasn't this guy. No, uh, it was this guy right here. So you need a new leader. Boom, and there we go. A siege. No, no, he's he has no siege. I thought I saw the four on maneuver, and I was like, I thought uh, I just my brain went to four on siege, but no, it was just maneuver. All right, Jin. Fabricate one claim over there. We're just going to knock out Jin just because they're kind of ugly. Sticking into our side like that. I want to take their territory. Almost. Actually, we capped out. We finished that. I think we, we were constructing a lot of buildings, and I think all those are done. Yeah, they are. Trying to improve relations with France. If we had one European ally... That would go cool. France would benefit from a, would benefit hugely from a, an alliance with me. I mean, they don't like me, but they would still benefit from the from you know being my ally. I would be you know their strength of arm for their colonies, and on this side of the world, and the trade potential would be huge. I'm trying to convince myself 
I'm, I'm like trying to convince the AI France that they should be my friend. It's just not gonna happen. I got the Netherlands on my side, but they're not willing to really do anything. They'd they get squashed if they tried. Because they have very, very little little land to actually do anything with. <sighs> Another province converted. Another province. Right, you guys can hang out right here for now. Let's actually yeah, put you in this one where the where the army's hanging out. Nice. Now we're gonna Should I declare war on Portugal again? I feel like I should. I wanna fight them. It's just they're gonna pull in a huge army. Huge. Like they they'll pull in all of Great Britain, because if we they'll, they'll pull in Cast Castile I'm not worried about, but Aragon I'm not worried about, but Great Britain. They'll pull in Great Britain. Luck. Those bastards get luck. And they, let's see, and all their protectorates. Brunei, Castile, Aragon, the U.S., Great Britain. It's just so many. Uh, oh. Where are the, how did I miss those? Which ones were those two? I don't even know which ones those were. Maybe I was converting them before? It's this one and this one, yeah. I think I was, no, 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 that one I'm converting right now. I think it was those two. Okay. Thank you. Seriously? Not making any progress on this. I made 1% progress so far. 1%. Oh, is not allowed to convert to another religion. I don't think I am allowed to change this. Nope, not allowed to manually change that. Alright, some ships finished. I just feel like this navy needs to be a little bit stronger. This one's good, though. It's 28, 28 heavy ships, basically. That one I'm happy with. I should, what I should do, if I'm going to do this, I should unmothball them, because I plan on doing it. Any, you know, the game is coming to an end in 20 years. I might as well. Might as well throw caution to the wind. Let these ships repair so they're not doing it on the fly. And have them patrolling out over here. I need, I'm going to need a general for over here. I would like a general for over here, at least. You guys are stuck right there. Oregon, you f I feel like you should have a bigger... bigger army and a bigger navy. Yeah, your navy's decent. How? What are these? Light ships. Transports. It's light they don't have any heavy ships. Let these guys get all the way up. If I need to, I can always transport one of these armies over to the other side, but I don't think I'm going to need to. Chances are they're going to invade Australia again like they always do. Alright, almost done with these other ships over here. January of 1802. Yeah, I've got a huge army over here, so... I mean, like, did you see, do you remember what I did to the English last time they tried to fight me? I wiped the floor with them. Alright, revolt! Yay! Alright, oop, no, 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 not you. You stay exactly where you are. I need these ships to go hang out with this fleet right here. Well, let's put this fleet right here. On, on Taiwan. Man, I remember when Taiwan was just like, you, you know, my, my 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 territory was right here. It was just boom right there, and Taiwan was really far off. And now it's just I c I control this whole both sides of the strait. All right, seventy ships, twenty one heavies, forty nine for uh, 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 archipelago frigates. Let's um, let's fuck with Portugal. Holy War, show superiority. Should we do that? Diplo power for 100%. Okay, no. if I take <laughs> take capital, that would be the day. Let's just do show superiority. 
Levying additional taxes. Um, we need the money right now, so... Let's, uh... Let's do it. Or should we declare war on Castile? And see who they drag in. Uh, let's... Let's see what Castile's allies look like. Because they're allied with England too, aren't they? Castile, allied with Corsica, Portugal. Uh, recall... Yeah, let's recall that diplomat from France. He, he, he got as far as he was going to get. A positive, currently negative 75. Okay, so let's declare war on, on Castile. Take Jugger, declare war. Crush Portugal. Rule the sea. Uh, let's see. What do they want us to do? No other nation should have a bigger fleet than we do. We need to increase the size of our fleet. That's the most size of the line. All right, so. Have less heavy ships. Okay, mission 16. Any known country have less heavy ships than it is. Oh, uh, I don't know. Ledger. Let's go to military. Armies. Navies. Uh, heavy ships. Great Britain has 58. I have 49. So I would need 11 more. So we could do that, right? Send that out. Okay. Crank that up. Okay. Let's reduce our inflation. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, that actually is... I hate using admin power like that, but we needed to get it a little bit lower. Not really creeping down as quickly as I had hoped. We need a... Oh, we're, we're maxed out here. So why don't we get one leader here? Nice. Very good leader. And let's put you here. You're going to work your way down this way. Start conquering these guys. We are going to make sure our fleet is out here patrolling. So we're going to send them over here and have them patrol out this way. Uh, we need the prestige. You start patrolling here. Alone is coming due. I forgot about that. No big deal. All right. So who'd they drag in? Everybody. They 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 brought everybody with them. Magnus, Australia, Chu, Hachi, Japan, Magnus, Australia, Oregon. And I don't even go through this list. But basically, uh, Portugal and Great Britain joined in. Unfortunate for me. Whew, would you look at the size of that army? Outnumbers me by a lot. But hopefully we're going to keep them off... Of the from keep them from dropping their uh, their troops by having our powerful fleet patrolling. We need to create more heavy ships right now to finish that. So let's build some three deckers. Let's actually put this down to speed one. We're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That should be enough. Alrighty, now. Let's fight these bastards. You are some natives, it looks like. And then we'll go take out this British Mexico one. We're just going to overrun everything we possibly can, basically. British Mexico, they have some—they have a small fleet. Should have a fleet over here. Maybe I'll send that fleet of 12 new heavy ships over here. I'm just going to attack with this this army right here, and we'll let the the, the the ones, the 21 there, just hang out. I mean, we have a, such a great general here. A fire of six. And he has a fire of zero, so ooh, it's going to be bad for them. That's going to that's gonna be really ugly for them. Yeah, massive losses, even on the fire phase. Yep, completely wiped out. So we're just going to keep this going. That one's going there. Try to keep our armies together for the most part. You can actually just hop over here to Portugal if you like. Who's occupying this stuff? Chukchi? Occupied by Corsica. 
Uh, how do I have any patrol? So, if I click here... Will he patrol back and forth? Let's, let, let's watch him really closely and see. I don't know if he will, but he might. That and, and yeah, oh okay, there he goes. And it's take take core jugger. So this army, I forgot about the I forgot to do anything with these guys. So you're gonna You're gonna grab on here. I didn't think this through too much, and we're gonna drop you in Jugger. Or not. We're going to attach you to a no, you're just I want you to attach to that transport. Or will it not make an a, a, a amphibious landing for some reason? Attached to transport, and well, why don't we just dump you right here then? Seriously? What the fuck? Have to do it that way? Okay, never mind. Whatever. I'm afeard the British are going to bring, uh, bring in a huge fleet, but I should be okay. Sword of the Dymo, Prestige, yes. We got our other ships going, and you finished right here, so you move down to this one. We're going to just overrun as much territory as we can in America. We're going to have to fight the U.S., too. They have a powerful, powerful military. But so do we. So do we. Let's see. Where's the USA on here? Oh, we're not fighting the U.S. We're not fighting. We don't have to fight the U.S. So we're, we pretty much have free reign over the Americas right now. Okay, this one's not going to go on its own. Because they have a huge garrison there. Cleansing heresy, that's fine. Converted some heretics, that's great. Now... All right, we're almost in Jugger. So once we take Jugger, then we can just start rampaging around over here. And what I'm going to I'm just going to got to keep my eye on is this the, the this area over here. Make sure they don't cuz what they've always tried to do before is try to land in Australia to distract me and it's always worked. It's always very distracting. Feel like taking the British, some British land down here in Mexico is going to be the way to go. I don't know. They went over this way, so it looks like they're going to try to. Well, they're trapped now. They're probably going to try to counter siege this. Cochimi. Uh, another three months, four months. Those will be done. All right. Now you guys don't have anywhere to go, so I'm not sure what you were planning on doing there. Hachi. Ooh, Hachi. Thank you. All right, march into these areas over here. We're going to overrun all this stuff. We should probably go over here, overrun Portugal's lands there. I'm glad I, I'm not fighting alone in that I do have allies to help me out. All right, that is British Mexico versus Oregon. Hopefully Oregon should... Yeah, Oregon's going to win that. Yeah. All right, come over... Up here now. Take out these guys. Right, that should go pretty quickly. I appreciate Hachi and Chu. Chu, 21 regiments. Go. They are part of Magnus. Our interests are theirs. Intercolonial trade. Okay. Liberty desire, but mercantilism lose a mercantilism. Uh, Liberty desire is okay. For now. Just trying to keep an eye on down here. I gotta keep popping back every once in a while, making sure that they don't... You know what we should do? Is, is just do this. Build some, build some cannons here, and we'll just march them right down over there to at least get that going. Maybe take some land from Portugal. Alright. You head right here. Just gotta keep knocking these guys. They, they haven't been able to really put up a fight yet. It hasn't I haven't really taken any losses. I mean I'm still maxed out on Well, I'm only down a few thousand men. Just about maxed out. So we're gonna take out this one, then we're gonna take out this one. 
I like how most of Mexico is British and Norwegian. I find, I find that very, very interesting. I know eventually the British are going to send a fleet over here. They always have in the past. Yeah, these guys are barely taking any losses. That's tw so we outnumber them by about 10,000 men here. Have a much better general. Oof. Oh, look at those losses. 2,500 men per tick on the fire phase there. Oh, that was rough for them. So we're going to take this one here, then maybe we start moving into British Mexico here. This one's almost finished. I'm always so afraid of starting these wars, and then when they start out, it's like, oh man. They're the, on the other side of the planet. Think about how long it's going to take them to get over here and properly fight me. That's 12 new heavy ships. Pricey, though. Very pricey. That's okay, though. I can afford it right now. For now. Okay, heretics. We're making a little bit of progress. Tosa. Now, I thought that would be enough, but I guess it wasn't. Yeah, we're just we're just over. Who's this? Portuguese Louisiana. Okay, so let's um, let's send you up here to fight this army, and this army will work this way. This army will. Ooh, there we go. I was wondering if that was gonna that was gonna hit. All right, you're gonna work down over here. All right, we need a new one. Have an artist conquer our rival's province. Rival Barcura, a chief religious... I guess we'll just... And it's never going to happen, but whatever. Base tax and Echu. And that should be enough to let it go. To let it start ticking. And we have a powerful navy now. Biggest in the world. I thought I did 11. Oh, there's a 12th right there. I knew there was another one. Gonna take forever, but it actually started. Yep, it started. We could... Let's actually move these guys right here and actually expand the patrol route a little bit. Like to these three right here, just a little bit more. So start patrolling to there. Yeah, we'll go back and forth. Good. Let's actually utilize this new fleet. And by sending them right there. The Straits of Makassar. Portugal's got that whole island there. Alright, how are we doing? There's Well, while we're right here. Let's double back and take out this army. Is Portuguese Mexico? Portuguese Mexico. We lost a siege. That's what that just said, isn't it? Where do we lose a siege? I wasn't paying attention. Chuck Chi, I forgot. I didn't. I forgot where those guys were. So this army is going to take out all this shit up here. All right, good. We wiped them out. Uh, where did that army go? I don't see them. Well, let's keep going. I mean, we're right here anyway. Let's just keep going. Let's do this. Let's split in half. Oh, well, that's finished now, so let's move you up here. Finished coring. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna take all of this right here. Chuck Chi and Portugal are gonna get conquered. Well, Chuck Chi and Portugal's territory. All of Chuck Chi, a little bit of Portugal. As soon as we move, uh, Portuguese Mexico entered a <laughs> military alliance with Portuguese Louisiana. I would assume so. Let's split in half. Send you right here. Keep an eye on anything down here. Make sure nothing fishy's going on. Like this. Whoa! Uh, oh, uh, whoa. 
Whoa. Whoa. Hello. That, that, that's what I call fishy. Now, let's see, what do we got here? 54. Their entire fucking fleet is there. The whole goddamn thing. 54 heavy ships. You're heading... Okay, I'm gonna... Uh, they might take out this entire navy here. Hopefully some of them... survive. I don't know if they will. I don't even have... Do I have a leader here? I do. I'm losing heavy ships. Damn it. Yeah, this is a big loss for me. What else do they have in there? Transport. 86 transport. So it's 50... Their entire fleet is there. So I'm going to put my whole fleet together, see if we can fight them. We lost all of our heavy ships. Shit. That sucks. That sucks. You guys right here. No, no, no. Don't patrol. Just hang out there. You guys go back. Lick your wounds. 54 heavy ships. They, Their entire fleet is right there. But we have to end this episode, so we'll fight them again next time. If you've enjoyed this episode, just drop me a like, leave me a comment right down below, and if you're interested in more Benjamin Mangus Plays Europa Universalis 4, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you next time.